said, when you're great, I don't know where I'm going to be without you. And that is my testimony on today. I don't know about you. Amen. I was a disobedient person, a hard-headed person. Amen. For the grace of God, amen. Save me and kill me. Hallelujah. His love save me and kill me on today. And you are our host of God on today. God, we thank you. On today, you are our host of Hallelujah. Good morning. Hey, temple. Amen. And as my father-in-law said, good morning, Jesus. Hallelujah. God, we love you on today. Hallelujah. Today, amen, our invocation will be reading from Brother Lonnie Garland.
Please support the Arkansas Second Convocation financially by contributing a special gift next Sunday morning, July 25th, during our morning worship service. The inspirational thought for today, life is like making tea. Boil your ego, evaporate your worries, dilute your <laughs> sorrows, filter your mistakes, and get a taste of happiness. Ooh. Have a blessed Amen. We thank the Lord. Amen. For the announcements. Amen. On today. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Yesterday, um, I was getting ready to run out and uh, my wife had been playing a video. And I went out. I said, send it to me. And um, she sent it to me and I began to play it. And um, um, the man was speaking before he sang a song and he said, the storm won't end until it passes over. Amen. That is such a simple thing, but it's such a powerful thing. The storm will not end. Amen. Until it passes over. Amen. Sister Charma, you were talking about your issues. I often say all the time, but we pass the mic around. Amen. We never know what people are going through, know what they're dealing with. Amen. That's why we should be so careful how we treat people. Amen. But I want to let you know, amen, the storm won't end. Amen. Until it passes over. Amen. My Bible says, amen, beloved, think it's not strange. Amen. Amen. The fiery child that come upon you after some strange thing has happened to you. Amen. But rejoice. Amen. For we share in Christ's suffering. Amen. So amen. When sickness comes up on your body, amen. Don't get down. Don't get sad. Amen. Amen. Rejoice. Amen. For our Savior, amen, suffered on the cross. Amen for our sins. Hallelujah. It's time for the word of God on today. Hallelujah. Are you happy for the word on today? Hallelujah. I'm here to introduce the speaker on today. Amen. A faithful son of the house. Amen. One of our area own. Amen. Elder Leon Johnson. Hallelujah. Can you give him a hand on today? Hallelujah. I'm going to go old school today. I mean, God just put it in my spirit. I want you all to reach your hand towards it. Amen. I say oftentimes when you get up here, amen, it's not an easy task. Amen. I want you to be praying for this man as he comes forward. Amen. We repeat after me. God bless Elder Leon Johnson. Hallelujah. Amen. After the praise team has gone forth, we ask that you would stand. Amen. And welcome the man of God. Amen. Be praying for him as he comes forward. Amen. You're now in the hands of the praise team.
Jesus. Jesus. There's no one like you. No one like you. Can we have any praise of the night? Can we have any praise of the night? Have we called on Jesus this morning? Have we called on Jesus this morning? Won't he make a way? Won't he make a way out of the way?
You are of God, little children, and have overcome them. Because greater is he that is in you than he is in the world. My subject or text this morning, saints, would be greater he that is in you than he is in the world. My definition of great simply means greatness is a concept or state of superiority, affecting a person, object, or place. Greatness can also be referred in individuals who possess a natural ability to be better than all others. He who is in the world refers to the devil or Satan. There is no doubt that Satan, the evil one, is strong and fierce, but God is much more powerful, in other words, victorious, over Satan. For a brief moment, my mind go back and think as I was growing up as a little child. I heard and saw great people in the world. Great names such as Everest Persley, Muhammad Ali, John Wayne, Michael Jordan, whom I looked as a great basketball player. Church and Facebook land. We can all think of someone that has come and gone throughout the years that we call great. But this Sunday morning, I'm not concerned about the people we call great in our world. But this Sunday morning, I'm, I'm talking about Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, and how we can overcome the world. Take temple members. We are living in a time where the world loves it on. Right. The world teaches us it's okay to rob and to steal. Uh -huh. The world teaches us it's okay to be gay or bisexual. It's okay to itch and ears and they should turn away from their own for the truth. Right. But I can hear a small voice saying to the church, uh -huh. great is he that is in you that he is in the world. John 15 and 13, greater love has no man than a man lay down his life for his friends. Right. Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits, test the spirits, whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. Yeah. Let me bring this to a close. Many false missionaries are gone out into the world. Many false teachers are gone out into the world. Yeah. Many false deacons are gone out into the world. Many false preachers are gone out into the world. But Jesus Christ has overcome the world. He paid the price for you and for me. Facebook and all of God's people, will you let him be great in your heart today? Will you let him be great in your homes today? Will you let him be great on the job today? Revelation 3 and 20, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come in into him. He is greater than the president. He is greater than the government. He is greater than you, and he's greater than me. Let Jesus be great in your life today. Amen. When, you, when, I, try, when I try to do the good that I can, when I try to, to be that I, the best that I can, when I try to love my enemies, when I try to love my loved ones and my family and my friends and all them that walk away, but, I'm, but I keep telling myself, great is he that is in me than he is in the world. The Lord will fight your battle. He will be great in a, in a time of sorrow. He will be great in a time of sorrow. Great. He's great in the noonday. He's great in the evening. He's great in the midnight hour. Amen. Heaven and earth shall pass away, but God's word will stand. God's word is great, saints. God's word is powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, dividing asunder of souls and spirit and of the joints of the hearts. But saints, will you let him be great today? Would you try, if, if you try it like Jesus, some say, songs say he's all right. He's all right today, saints. If you try Jesus, he's great. When a doctor walk out on you, he's great. When friends and family walk away, he's great. 
COVID-19, he's still great. High blood pressure, he's still great. Low blood pressure, he's still great. Wait, he's still great. If you try my Jesus, he's all right. John said, uh, a many shall call on that name, Lord, 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 on that last day. And he's going to say, I know you're not. I know you're not. But say, let him be great in your hearts today. Will you let him fill your heart with love? Will you let him fill your heart with peace? Will you let him fill your heart with laughter? Amen, amen, amen. Get ready, saints. Get ready, saints, when he comes. Don't you want to be ready when he comes? Don't you want to be ready when he comes? Don't you want to be great in your life? Don't you want him to be happy when you come? Amen, amen. Be great today, saints. Be great today, saints. Be great today, saints. Hang in there today, saints. I know what it looks like on TV. I know what it looks like in our church houses today. I know what it looks like in our schools today. I know what it looks like in our homes today, saints. But have you tried my friend Jesus? He's all right. He's all right today, saints. Oh, he's all right today, saints. Have you tried my friend Jesus? He's all right. Great is he that is in me. And he is in the world. He's greater than the drug dealer. He's greater than the doctor. He's greater than the lawyer. He's greater than the judge. Oh, I know he's great. He's great in the morning. And he's great, saints. I know I gotta go to my seat, saints. But if you cry, my friend Jesus, he's all right. He's all right. But he got up early one Sunday morning. Got up early one Sunday morning and looked back at the grave. Said the grave can't hold me down. Heaven and earth adore me. I have the power to lay down my life. Jesus said I have the power to take it up again. Amen. But one day, he's going to call you by your name. But will you be ready? When he called my name, Leon. The unjust and junior. I want to be ready, Pastor. When he comes, when he stretch me high wide and take me low, I just want to be ready. When he comes, can't no grave hold you down. If your life is anchored in the Lord, can't no sickness overtake you. If your soul is anchored in the Lord, can you say yes? You say yes. Yes to your will. Yes to your way. Yes, I will obey. Oh! Oh! oh. Right in me. In me. And he is in the world. The world loves his own. The world loves his own. But will you be ready? Let the blind lead the blind. Let the goat be with the sheep. Let the tail drink grow with the wheat. And Jesus said, I do the separation. Let them talk. Let the back bite keep walking. And keep talking, keep on talking. But on that day, on that very last day, with my Savior crack the sky. With my Savior crack the sky. Great is he that is in you that he is in the world. I don't know what kind of lifestyle like a George live in, every person live. I know that they're great in the world. Mm -hmm. yes. But I know a man that greater, greater oh, yes. that paid the price yes, for sir. me and for you. Yes. Ooh, Jesus, Jesus. What, what greater friend than a friend to lay down Ooh. his life yes. for me? Thank you. For you. Yes. And you and you and you and you. Yes. What a friend we have in Jesus. Yes. We can take all of us grief. We can bear it. Yes. My God, my God. Yes, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. If you want to follow somebody, if you want to 
Put your trust on somebody. Don't put them in Michael Jordan. Elvis Presley. Muhammad Ali. Our president. But put your trust in Jesus. He's the only one that can save you. I can't even save you. I got to save myself. Paul said, Lord, to me. I preach to others and I'll be a castaway. Hey, 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 hey. Thank you, God. Because they all this preaching and all this standing up here. Say that, say that, say that. God bless you, wide open. My God, my God. The disciples asked Jesus, said, who can be saved? With God, all things are possible. When man counts you out, saints, when man counts you out, when man says you can't do it, Take it to God. Yes. I know what I'm talking about. Hallelujah. Yes, I got I've seen him do some things that I know there was a God. Yes. Yes. If you want to be healed, if you want to be saved, just want to say, look at anyone. Get more of him. Get more Fast and pray. Yes, yes, yes. And I know that COVID 19 is here, and I know what it looks like, but it, if you got your soul rooted and anchored in the Lord, yes, sir, yes, sir. you don't have to worry. Hallelujah. I think about the five very foolish versions and the one that was wow. wasn't foolish. Saints, don't let your light burn out. Yes, yes, Keep your lamp lit. Yes, sir, yes, sir. So when the Savior comes, yes, you'll be ready. Yes, yes, I know I'm right. Yes,
God, there is a need on today, God. Meet each and every person, God. Right where they stand on today, God. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Touch them from the crown of their head, God, to the soles of their feet, God. Move in a mighty way, God. Out of their repressed repair, God. In the name of Jesus, God. Hallelujah. And we call it done, God. Right now in the name of Jesus, God. We seek more of you, God. More of your spirit, God. More of your soul. In the name of Jesus, God. And God, we allow you to be great in our lives on today. Have your way in our souls, God. Hallelujah, God. For you are the great I am. You are omnipotent, God. You are mighty, God. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. If you believe that prayer on today, God, we pray, amen, that God is able to your life and touch your soul on today. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Please. Amen. Remain standing. Amen. We thank you for the word on today. Hallelujah. We cannot leave this place. Amen. We're not hearing. Amen. From our leader. Amen. So at this time, amen. Our leader is trying to say, Amen. First administrative assistant. Amen. And superintendent. The Lord will be pleased in my hand. Come on, say praise the Lord. Right here, amen. Some of you, I know two 
know and the other you may not the Thank other you. church you may not know uh, this is Ruth and T. Knox amen blessed us with a $500 donation Ooh. for the building blessed us with a 250 and he said there are more to come. Amen. 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 I like that more to come. Amen. Praise God. You can fill up your gas tank once but you're going to have to go back and do it again. <laughs> Just keep riding. Amen. There's going to be some more. So he says more to come. Amen. And there was a church Many of y'all probably remember Brother Giles that used to sing with the group, the, the young men. I think it was like three or four of them used to sing yeah, together. Yeah. And they think uh, Reverend Giles' son. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. His, he was at a church in Maumelle, from what I understand, and then they decided to close their church. And uh, and they thought about Tate Temple through Amen. Brother Justin. Right. Rather than, I guess, taking the money and splitting it among the deacons or with the preacher or the members of one, they thought about take temple. That's all right. The money that they had, some money in their treasure. So they made a contribution to take temple for $1,200. that are steady coming in and, uh, and I have I don't have no sense to believe that others going to be coming to because I serve the God of wealth yeah. of riches yeah. amen hallelujah yeah. glory to God so God don't need it in heaven he don't have to go to the grocery store he don't have to pay the rent he don't have to pay the light bill and, amen but he know we need it. So he's blessing. He's blessing. So keep praying. Keep praying. Keep trusting the Lord. That everything's going to be all right. Hallelujah. Don't forget, as they stated, that this holy convocations begin on Tuesday. Amen. Tuesday night. Bring a new Bible way in North Little Rock. And uh, Tuesday night, I believe you say, well, music night. It'll be music, musical on Tuesday night. So if you can make it come, be a part of the service. We certainly don't want to miss Wednesday night. Amen. The fourth jurisdiction, third jurisdiction of Arkansas will be with us. Bishop Jones, Thursday night again. Bishop with us. Except the first jurisdiction. And we'll be honoring Bishop D.L. Lindsay also on Thursday night. Amen. This is how we honor him during the convocation and on Thursday nights. He was with us about 35 years, I believe. Amen. Bishop Lindsay. And so he reached kind of like retired, and, but he's still with us. Amen. I saw him on the Facebook, I believe, yesterday. He was at a funeral. He was walking with a cane, but he still was. Yes, so we want to keep him lifted up in prayer. And hopefully.
hopefully we will see him Thursday night in our convocation. And Friday night, Bishop Anderson, our jurisdictional bishop, will be speaking to us. So plan your week to be with us, if you can, at the Holy Convocation. It won't be like it used to be in Hot Springs at the Convention Center. Amen. We will pack that place out on Sunday. Amen. But uh, due to the, the virus, uh, we will not be there this year. Hopefully, the Lord will bless us in 2022. We can return to the Hot Springs Convention Center and just pack it out again. Praise God. All right. I believe that's, I believe Deacon Frank was on, but he's in the finance office. Amen. So we're going to, if there's nothing else, we're going to let you go. Sunday school, don't forget this afternoon. Uh, next Wednesday night, Wednesday night, there will be no Bible study. On next Wednesday night, I'll be probably announcements. So don't forget, we will be in the Holy Convocation. At this time, we're going to stand. Thank you for coming. Thank you, my guests, for being here. Amen. And always welcome. And I get for our service. <laughs> All right. Oh, say that they're not guests anymore. <laughs> but we thank God for our new members being here. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, 
Thank you.